in the name of Jesus the son of the living God I declare father there are men and women here who have been in the cave of Adullam going through the trainings of the spirit fasting building going through shame going through reproach for the sake of the witness like John in the Isle of Patmos on account of the testimony of their witness they have endured many things they have received many stripes father I pray in the name of Jesus to you O God of my covenant let fire from heaven that is able to anoint and equip men and women let it fall right now at the count of three one two three take that fire take that fire take that fire take that fire oh Deborah, i speak to you arise by the spirit women in the order of anna sarah deborah in the name of jesus men and women of the gospel i speak to you i place upon you the grace for the prophetic the grace for the apostolic the grace for the evangelistic the dreams that you had i give life to them by the power of the holy ghost receive receive hear me there are some of you like esther the palace is your destiny it's time for that grace to come upon you i stand like hey guy the keeper of the king's virgins there is an oil i'm about to give you you will need that oil for ahazaros to receive you therefore i stretch my hands may the esther anointing come upon everyone here called into government called into influence take that grace take that grace take that grace politicians take that grace members of parliament take that grace captains of industry take that grace there are men and women who need to step into dimensions of wealth transfer because of the assignment it's not just about the products and the services that you offer alone that is principal but there is a grace that is connected to prophecy and destiny i want to pray for you lord mantles that make for wealth and prosperity not just for self-aggrandizement i stand by the privilege of god the god of heaven who is the helper of us all ebenezer the one who can help men i speak to you carry that mantle now carry that grace now upon your business carry that grace now in the name of jesus please pay attention we are receiving an impartation there are women here who are like mary what is in your womb is more than a child you are betting saviors i stretch my hands in the name of jesus i decree and declare by the power of the holy spirit the grace to step into prophecy may that grace rest upon you now oh, your lifting has come oh, your lifting has come there are music ministers here God has been training you, but this nation has not heard your songs. Africa is yet to hear your songs. I place grace upon your worship. I give it wings by prophecy. I stand by the rod of the apostolic and the prophetic. I push you. Speak to the nations. Sing to the nations. In the name of Jesus Christ. There are people here that have the destiny of saviors. Your families are at the mercy of your rising. 
but it looks like there are powers sitting on your destiny that have vowed that you will never rise i stand by the god of my covenant the one who called me any power sitting upon your prophecy any power sitting upon the next level of your life i come by two rods of the apostolic and the prophetic i scatter it right now i scatter it right now i scatter it right now find visibility in the name of jesus christ hear me there are some of you god has given you a king maker anointing you don't become kings yourself but you can enthrone kings and you can remove them it's a dimension of the prophetic but you have not walked in it yet in the name that is above all names i stretch my hands and i declare the grace to enthrone kings receive that grace now in the name of jesus 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 everything that your hands have started but mysteriously you have not been able to finish because there are powers that stand he says once again i desire to come to you but satan hindered us in the name of jesus christ in the name that is above all names i declare the finisher's anointing may it rest upon you the finisher's anointing the finisher's anointing take that grace now we're rounding up don't be tired hear me he said isaac dug a well and the philistines covered it he dug another well they covered it he dug the third one and they left him he called it rehoboth he said god has given me my own space can i tell you this i want to pray for you you must be tired of escorting people in destiny and not finding a place lord where is my place in this city financially spiritually that god is a god of portions i speak to you let me first speak to this city abuja hear the word of the lord i speak by the rod of the apostolic and the prophetic the portion of god's people in the name of jesus deliver to them now deliver to them now and every nation you are watching from every territory and region you're following from your portion in that land the bible says as for the earth out of it comes bread he said the increase of the field is for all that even the king eats from the increase may your portion come to you in the name of jesus christ two more prayers and we're done want to crush the powers that fight visibility please understand what i'm telling you it says and i if i be lifted up christ cannot be glorified when we are in hiding god must give us elevated platforms of influence some of you in the area of royalty some in the area of government in business by god's grace we have sufficient spiritual intelligence to know that spirituality blindly without influence will not be able to do much for the kingdom from a territorial standpoint are we together there is a grace that makes for visibility some of you have served god acceptably you have your small prayer groups you have your different platforms and you have been serving faithfully but you are now asking lord how will i be lifted it takes prophecy to lift you and here comes the prophetic word i decree and declare to you in the name that is above all names by the power that raised christ from the dead the platform that you need for the next season of your life to glorify jesus the platform you need for the next season of your life to bring nations to the cross the platform you need the elevated platform 
that translates to nation building that translates to kingdom advance that translates to the betterment of lives i speak to you by prophecy rise to that level rise to that level rise to that level rise to that level I will not be silent. I will always Let it be your commitment. As long as, as, long as I am breathing, I. One more time with understanding and I, will, and I will not be silent. I will always worship you as long as Please listen carefully. Let's just listen to this prophetic instruction. Now, I want to challenge you. Please just discipline yourself and obtain grace and submit to this training and what, what happens in your life. I want to challenge you all together as a family of faith, global. Let's obtain grace from God that from tomorrow up until Saturday, trust God for grace from 12 midnight to 12.30 let it find you praying 12 midnight koinonia global everywhere please put it on social media invite anyone across this is not just a koinonia thing we are sent to the body of christ 12 on the dot do yourself a favor don't worry if you are on a medical if it's a medical thing that's all right and maybe little children that go to school that's all right you can pray for them but every priest 12 on the dot